Oh, that's a long, long story. Uh, a few friends of mine who were playing poker online said it's a great game, and I've always played like five card draw. And I decided to start online. I started online with Labrooks. Um, I've learned a lot since then, but that was the way it was all started. I'd carry on doing what I'm actually doing, which is making my living in, in, well, sort of in the warranty game. Um, I've got family, and, and they're the most important side of my life, which is, you know, the family side. I've got a great family within the poker community, and I would I, I hope that never ends because it's great fun. Um, but the main side of it is the family side of it. Um, favourite place to play poker is Dublin. Uh, that's where I started with my first main event. It was uh, the Irish uh, Poker Championships. Uh, only lasted 13 hands, uh, and I was all geared up for it. And thought I was a great player. I had kings twice. I had ace king once, and before I knew it, I was out of the tournament. But it's still my most favourite memory, just outside of Dublin. Long to time it would be Liverpool to win the Premiership. Uh, uh, <laughs> Liverpool to win the Premiership. <laughs> <laughs> um. Oh, there's so many. There's so many. Um. I'd love to play Ian Fraser, Ian Fraser heads up for bank rolls because I think he's a great player. I think he's really solid. Um, just for the crack would be Liam Flood, who I think is the main gentleman of poker. Um, to get drunk it would be Par Reg. Um, just to how to be the best dressed would be Marcel Lusk. Um, and that's as far as I'm going, because if, if I start going, I might start insulting people, so I'm leaving it at that. <laughs> um, that's a hard question. I mean, we're both about the same age. Uh, I like the way Devil Fresh dresses. Um, and it, he, he's a stylish guy. He's a proper stylish guy. Um... For the suits, I think I've got a little bit more, a, a bit more repertoire than he has. Uh, for the casual gear, it's got to be Devilfish. He's great. Oh, poker, poker all day long. Beer. <laughs> uh, I'm 50 years old and probably still sex. <laughs> Omaha. Marty Smith. Oh, Nicky. Nicky all day long. Uh, in terms of tournament wins, um, was it was here last year at Kalani and I, and I took a trophy home. Um, in terms of cash wins, you know, they're, they're, they're between us and the guys who I've played with. Uh, in terms of online wins, again, that's between me and the poker site that I play on. Um, well, I suppose uh, taking it down here in Kalana last year was a, was a great thing, and I really enjoyed that. Because if you look at my table, <laughs> there's probably seven, eight, nine, ten dice there. Uh, I, only, I only fit enough into the box that I've got at the time, but dice, I've got hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of them, and it's what people buy me. 
people go away to different countries and they come back if they see a dice which they think is is right for me then they come back with it and sometimes I've got it sometimes I've not and I put them all to the middle of the collection but it all started from a, um, a little crystal dice which the kids bought me and it was a Shirovsky crystal it was a, a crystal dice with loads of little red um, crystals on it that dice is virtually bare now but uh, a guy in uh, Leo's Casino uh, I I had a hand, and I'm only messing. I know it rolls six. It rolls six every time. So I've rolled, I've rolled the dice, and I said to the guy, I said, if it goes six, I'm going all in. Knowing full well that the, like, the dice is loaded. Look, go six, and I've gone all in. I mean, I've gone all in. The board's gone ace, ace, three, three. And underneath my hand, I've got aces. And the guy, the dealer just shouted, that's the dice, man. <laughs> and that's where the name came from. <laughs>